previously. Housemates nominated. Is Maisie. 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 Fear. Fear. Maisie. She leaves talc everywhere. So it's girl on girl eviction. Maisie and Fear face the public vote. Can't bother this. I'll just sit in a bar. Don't need to sit in a bar for six weeks. But Mark revealed he might walk. I feel like I'm ready now to go out and find a real job. Tonight. The house becomes a toy factory. Oh my God! The housemates act like kids. And the big boss flexes his muscle. A little bit bad news for you. I'm going to have to let you go. And a housemate's revelation leaves everyone in tears. Dear 26 9 a.m. Last night, Fear and Mirzi discovered they will face a public vote this week. You've just got Carol on. I know you've really had to break the tumble here. That hair. But I feel like it's ever since me and Faye sort of become friends with you, just maybe for you to get up as an eye. Oh, I don't need anything to do now. I don't, any, I don't think anybody thinks you two have, like, a little witch's corner where you just cackle about it. Yeah, no, maybe not. It's just, do you know what else is really hard to help? Because, like, my best friend from the house is always like, imagine if it was just you and Alex. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because either way, you're going to, like, be upset. Yeah. Obviously, you don't want to go, but then you don't want Faye to go either, do you? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's... Oh, that's completely understandable. What's meant to be is meant to be, though. I, I always say that, so... Yeah. It's all right. It's weird, I don't know if you find it, like, being for nomination, like, if you do anything fun, <laughs> you then get frowned upon because it looks as if you're trying no, to not, stay no, in. No, you might get frowned upon about, uh, by people in the house. Yeah. But, as Aaron showed, it might be really popular with the outside world. Remember when Aaron was first up on the eviction, he kissed yeah. the boy, he took his willy out. Remember, these are two characteristics that we didn't know Aaron was like before, yeah. is it? Seems Willie out and kissed the boy. Yeah. You know, and the, do you know what? The public love those two things. You know, a lot of us were like, nah. I can't get my Willie out, I'm afraid. Yeah, I'll tell you what, do what you want to do. You know, and if, if you want to have sex, then I'm. Oh, I do. You know? sure. <laughs> I'm more than happy to help. Wolfpack will uh, help you on that one. Yesterday, Mark revealed he was thinking about leaving the Big Brother house. Morning, Big Brother. Good morning, Mark. Mark, last night you told Big Brother that you were going to sleep on a big decision. Yeah. What's the outcome? Uh, I'm just going to sort of roam about and stay for a bit. Yeah, that's all right. I'm just not ready to make such a big decision, just willy-nilly. Like, I've never said willy-nilly before, but, like... You told me not to take the decision lightly, so I'm not going to. Ugh. I don't just want to, like... Like, run away, if you know what I mean. Ten fifty-two am For this week's Shop and Task, housemates will work in Big Brother's toy factory, producing teddy bears, dolls and decks of cards. As Jir decided he was the bossiest housemate, he is factory manager. He's appointed Arden and Anton as duty managers. I'll be easy on you guys. The rest of the house will become factory workers. Hello, of course. Cheers. All right. To aid productivity, Big Brother has provided a full English breakfast for the management and porridge for the workers. It's the best breakfast I've seen yeah. in my life. Uh -huh. What have you looked at? <laughs> porridge. It's literally like bird food. There isn't any jam there. Now get off! I don't want you to put your plate like that. Why are you such a stressful... <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm going to put that in my stomach? It's glued to the plate. 
so much better than sausages and hash browns. I know. Yeah, I'm <gasps> Squeeze my finger. Don't. What? Ow. Oh. Excuse me, um, we've got a worker who's gone mad already. <laughs> Wow. He's gonna help you. Do it. What are you gonna do if he does it? You're gonna fire him? No. Do it, do it. Why? <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> it's all warm. I've got moisture and warmness on my crutch. Oh, you two, Can you tell him? Calm down now, you two. Oh, my God, Mark. Mm -hmm. I didn't put it on. This wasn't a product. This is, this is your mate Aaron. 11.10 a.m. The factory workers are clocking on for this week's shop and task. I'm sure I thought it was actually clocking clock out machine. Oh. oh, my God! Oh, my God, little boots! To oh, win gosh. a luxury shop and budget, they must make enough toys in each of three shifts. Oh, my God, there's a reject bin. Teddy oh, cares. I spent half my life in there. In their first shift, they must stuff and dress 120 teddy bears. We've got to stuff the teddies. Yeah. I bet we have to fail this task I feel like to pass it. To it. We've got to fail to pass it? I reckon. Why do you think that? Witty. I could be wrong. What, you don't think we're making teddies? No, I reckon there'll no. be a twist. Yeah, I think we're supposed to fail to pass. Jia and his duty managers have been given a posh executive office for the duration of the task. Oh, oh you've got a snooker oh, table! Oh, oh, my God! <laughs> Oh, oh yes. my uh, Their job is to make sure that workers meet their targets. Oh, you have a fucking snooker table. All right. I'm coming in here a lot. You do know that. Uh, I love this is the best task ever. Oh, look, I'm doing it good. This is good. You lose it in the I, think, I think it's best to, like, break this. <laughs> Mine was a really fat one, you know. Look at that. How cute is that? Really cute. Oh. Look at him. What a legend. These are the cutest outfits I've ever seen. Oh, my God. A lot of stuffing goes into one there, actually. Even though they're tiny. They can take a lot of stuff in there, can't they? So. Yeah, they can. Merry Christmas. Ho, 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 ho. Ho, 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 ho. Coming up, Tom and Mirzi are set secret missions. So, oh, yeah. OK, OK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm ready to go. But Aaron and Mark risk losing the shopping budget. Eleven thirty seven AM. To dear housemates are working in a toy factory. To win a luxury shop and budget, they must make toys to meet targets set by Big Brother. Oh, my God. In the first shift, they must stuff 120 teddy bears. Oh, oh my God. God. Who threw the teddy bear? Oh, Not me, Aaron. 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 Good one, Tom. Thank you for that. Who did he say he threw it? Did he say me? It was. Rain drops on roses and yeah, whiskers right, right. on kittens. <laughs> Rise pop and kettle and all the mittens. Brown paper packages tied up with string. string. These are a few of my favourite things. When the dog bites, when, when the bee stings, when I'm feeling sad, I simply remember my favourite things. The factory boss and a duty manager oh. are relaxing in their office. It's not a bad office, not a bad office at all. Do you think he's our eating there? Uh, it'll, be, it'll be all right. I, I, I need backup. Time to stop it now. Stop now! <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a teddy bear massacre. <laughs> 
11.55 a.m. Manager G is writing up a commendation for his favourite employee. Housemates have been stuffing bears for 45 minutes. This is Big Brother. Will one factory worker come to dive in? Gabby, Tom. Gabby. Go on, Tom. Oh, yeah. Tom, as you know, for today's task, the toy factory workers must fulfil an order of toys. If they are successful, housemates <coughs> may win a premium shopping budget of £300. Yeah. Tom, how would you like the chance to raise this to a luxury shopping budget of £500? Oh, yeah, defo! Big Brother has a very special secret mission for you. Oh, go on then. All you have to do is make more toys than any other individual housemate during the task. You must not tell any of your fellow housemates about your secret mission. So you don't blow your cover, Big Brother has come up with a cunning cover story for oh, you. Oh, you sly people. Is it to do with this bowl of fruit? It certainly is. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, I know what you're going to do. Go on. Tell me, quickly, quickly! Tom, take the fruit to your fellow factory workers. Yes! So, oh, yeah! OK, OK, can I go? Good luck, Tom. Oh, my God, yes! OK, boy! <laughs> You're doing really well. Don't worry, we'll get it for you. Cheers. I don't think we're working for that at all. I reckon we're working for them to get stuff. Yeah. They've gave us food. Oh, yeah. Yay. There's fruit and shit, oh, so God. everybody enjoy. Lou to the office. Lou to the you office. Get certain oh, stuff gonna get please please to the office, please. He's going to make you suck oh, his dick. God. Oh, God. Harry, Harry, that's horrible. What? It's true. Harry. Harry. It's true. You've got to put... What do you normally do on this? You put a colour, then a red? Yeah. I thought you put it a red, then a colour. Yeah, red, then a colour, yeah. Yes, Bart. Are you all right? Which no, one did you, hear, did you hear us twice or once? I got you twice then. Yeah, uh, can I have a cup of coffee, please? Yes, boss. And then you can fucking sue them for five. Oh, I'll give you, there you go, there's your certificate for being a good worker. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thanks, boss. Hey, boss. See you later. See you in a bit, Lou. Have a nice day, boss. Thanks. See you later, you. See ya. Right. Twelve twelve p.m. Factory workers have been stuffing bears for one hour and two minutes and have stuffed just 41 bears, of which Tom has been responsible for nine. This is Big Brother. Will one factory worker come to dive in? I will. Louise. Factory boss G is hard at work. Well, that went well. Hello. Maisie, as you know, for today's task, the toy factory workers must fulfil an order for toys. If they are successful, they may win a premium shopping budget of £300. Yeah. How would you like the chance to double this shopping budget <gasps> to a ludicrous £600? Yes, 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 yes. Big Brother has a very special secret mission for you. Fuck. All you have to do is make more toys than any other individual housemate during the task. OK. This is a secret. You must not tell any of your fellow housemates about your secret mission. Good luck, Maisie. Okay, you may now leave the diary room. Thank you. One or two p.m. Factory boss G is putting pen to paper. Four, four he had to improve. Oh, okay. Really? Yeah. Okay, so that's okay. an eight. Oh, so you're actually probably checking them as well, you mm -hmm. Little bit of a, a morale booster coming up. Just to get pro productivity growing. Please don't be a rat. Growing and stuff. And stuff. Teddies are made in the Big Brother factory. 
All of our workers are crazy and they're wacky. We want the shopping, we want the booze. So it's up to you if we win or run or lose. So make teddies and teddies and teddies and teddies. Teddies and teddies and toys. And Mark and Aaron, behave yourself with the rest of the girls and boys. Woo! I'm sweating. I am working so hard. <laughs> Why don't you just go in and take your log clothes off the fold you need to get tired? Wait, how many does they have? I think we're meant to meet the quota, but not by too much. They said they don't want too much of a surf bill. Go, but harder. Is this all you? Yeah. Honestly. Right. Yeah, I've been doing it. Oh, it's Maisie's doing amazing, you know. I've made a few as well, so. Tom, how many have you done? I don't know, because some of them aren't mine. Are you serious? Housemates have successfully stuffed 125 bears and passed this part of the task. Mirzi stuffed 15 bears, but Tom is the best stuffer with 21 bears. Three fourteen pm. Jeers come up with another great motivational idea. Your name spelled E N T O N, isn't it? Yeah. What are we doing? Need to boost the morale, didn't I? Yeah. So I'm going to write a poem about everyone, pass it round to let them know I care. It's pretty cool you got a pen and paper in it. And, uh, raise. I love these dresses, aren't they nice? Don't you? Yeah. I'd wear some of these, you know. For the second part of today's shop and task, housemates must assemble 200 dolls in two hours. How, how do you get these dresses on, can I ask? Oh, there we go. Just about. <laughs> is it just me or does anyone else find it slightly terrifying? Yeah, <laughs> little. I find it weird. It's out of a horror movie. Hi, I can turn my head. Wait a minute. Now. What are we? What are we actually doing then? Are we know. doing this? So, my back. I don't know. I don't oh know. Harry. Why don't we just do it? And if whatever. why don't we just do one each every time they come in? <laughs> How are they going to feel here if we fail? <clears throat> Hello, everybody. This is from the boss. This is for the special people in the BB house. This poem's from the chairman, Jim McCree, so check this bar boy out. Alex, you're hilarious. You love your chocolate, have a laugh. Proper Jody, that's the same. Aaron, you're a good mate. I know you miss your son. But don't worry about that for the men. I know he's fine, have fun. Aww. Lou, you are gorgeous. Ooh. Proper wow on real. You're beautiful no, you're inside next. and out. You're defo the real deal. <laughs> Never been shady, love you, baby. Hope the gate is on the cards. <laughs> I'll wine and dine you out of here. Just you mark my words. Aww. Mark your off it. You better do some graft. Our top dog, Jay McCree, will have to kick your ass. <laughs> but seriously, mate, you know the oh, sketch. Yeah. I love you, bro, I do. So please, please, please let us win this task. And later on tonight, 
I might just kiss your ass. Yeah. Over and out, Jim oh. McCrea boss. Oh. That was brilliant. So Louis, a date on the cards. Mm. Is a date on the cards. That's Louis? amazing. Louis, a date on the cards. Yeah. Hey. Oh. That was really good. Bless her. Yes, Lou. Coming up, G starts sack and staff. A little bit bad news for you. I'm gonna have to let this go. Was that it? And Mark sacks off Big Brother. That's it. I think I'm ready to go. Four or eight p.m. For this week's shop and task, housemates have become factory workers. They don't know it yet, but they've passed the first part of the task. They've now got to assemble 200 dolls in two hours. Tom and Mirzi have individually been set secret missions to make the most toys. Secret task is just going so pear-shaped. Literally, people are taking it so seriously and just working so fast. Tom and Alex just like... How many dolls have you currently made? About 20. And they're on about 20, 20-something. 20 have you tried making dolls faster? I'm trying faster, but they're so different. I'm doing it as fast as I possibly can. I'm sweating out as well. I'm on the same amount as them, basically. Maisie, Big Brother would like to remind you that breaks are optional. I know they're optional, that's why I came in here for my break. Model employees Alex and Tom have been called to the boss's office. You've been summoned into my office because you two are the best workers. Yay! Well done, guys. Come on. I've voted we've for. We've, we've, had, we've, had, we've, had a, we've had an eye on you. Voted by me. To factory managers. Thanks, guys. <coughs> Since you've been a good worker, you get a gold star. Ah, yes. Yeah, well done. Yeah. Thanks, Tom. So you're our two top workers. Okay. No, honestly, honestly, you two have been really good since the start, so keep up. You, you both worked Thanks, really guys. hard. Really hard. Thanks. She's very flexible, this one is. Oi! Can I just keep my ones for now and then you can destroy them at the end? I just want to keep my ones for now and just play them and then you can destroy them all at the end. I really, like, before they get it, you can destroy them all. I just don't need to destroy them yet. And then you can literally do it after. Out. Aaron, what are you doing? Out. Are you creeping around? I'm not walking Out. around. I'm trying to keep flexibility in my knee. What happened to her? <laughs> Twisted it and hurt it. Don't take any. What? You're pulling Faye's things apart. I'm not. But you've done something to mine as yeah, well. Yeah, Maisie's not quite sure. Tom's got them good. Ow. Oh, she's just not happening. Leave mine, leave mine. Me and Tom got, got gold stars. stars. We've got gold stars. Have you? Yeah, because yeah, we're the bestest workers. They're not. I've done well too. Best of we're arse. the bestest workers. Bestest we'll isn't the a bestest word. Bestest at grammar. And you're the most ugliest, sir. And looks the most like an owl. Owl. An owl. Owl. Yeah, hon. I can that. see your gold star from here. It's gleaming. I know. I can see yours as well. I'm blinded. Please don't destroy my dolls yet. Who's rubbed dolls out my box? These are all mine. I thought four people made them, four people pulled them apart. Some of mine have gone as well. Mm. Aaron, I can't believe you're doing nothing. But we failed on the first task anyway. Yeah, but that doesn't necessarily mean... It said you had to pass all three. All three? No, I didn't. Yeah. Well, if you had to pass all three, Jan, that would have just been like, what's the point of you doing this? Unless one? it's a fake task. Unless we're supposed to fail. You, what would people be getting stars then for doing really well? The three men in suits want us oh, to pass. Damn. Is this a fake tax? See, they're no. just trying to keep a straight face now. Yeah. This is our shopping budget. Ads, do you want to help Where's me? Where's the, the doll's gone? Well, it's called person called Harry and Aaron ripping them apart. 
every time you make one. We well, haven't touched them. Well, you can see him sat here. Hey guys, because like, I'm getting really hot from this. There's 13 minutes. in there. There's about five in there now. Somebody rubbed mine as Jay, well. Jay, they keep taking my dogs. Jay, Aaron ripped up some of my dolls. Uh, I've made 13 dolls and I've got like six left. Some of mine have gone as well. Why are you ripping dolls off? I don't know, Jenny. Someone's taking them all out of my box. I had ten in my box. I dare and started throwing them. That's you do realise I, I want to rip you apart like these dolls right now. Really? Literally <laughs> want to rip you <laughs> fucking yeah, apart. Chip peas for you all week, whether we make it or not. I wasn't doing it for your benefit. Get out. Big Brother team is waiting in the task room. Oh, don't they didn't, they didn't say shit. Get out. They did say that. Get out no. of the task room yeah. now. Before I escort you out. No, seriously, out. You really think I'm joking? I'll get Jay to pick you up and I'll throw you out. Go and pick Jay, get Jay to pick me up. Such a fucking wind up, <laughs> do you know that? <gasps> oh, good lord. Prick. What? Wow. Six forty-six p.m. So far, housemates have passed the first two parts of the task. Now they must sort playing cards into packs. There are over fifty thousand playing cards jumbled up, and the factory workers need to form fifteen full decks, each one in the right order. Is it Jack Quinking? Jack Quinking, yes. Oh, shit! Ready? Yes, Jack Quinking. Can anyone see the four clubs anywhere? One, two. Aha. Uh -huh. I think, like, when you look at these baskets, they all seem to be in order already. Do you? Yeah, yeah, they are picked Lord. I think, look, look at that. I've just. Guys, but I really. That if, guys, two, three, four, I. Five, guys, I've just six, picked seven, one. Eight, I, yeah, guys, I really think you just put your hands in and literally. <laughs> <laughs> There you go, look. Let's take a look. This is already in Mark, keep up the good work. Yeah, well, I don't know why Stay strong. Stay strong. I don't want it to let go. Like ten o'clock. I don't want it to let go. Don't touch me. Huh? Don't touch me. Don't touch me. That's why them two pricks look for nomination. Well, mine I think this is about the promotion. Afternoon, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I think it will be on my own. Pay rise. Yeah. So I'm glad. Keep calm. Exciting. Make toys, not war. I've got some little bit bad news for you. I'm having to make a few cutbacks. And since you are both, I've, I've seen more use out of a chocolate fire guard. You are useless. Do you know what I mean? You are shocking. I take offence to that. Lads. All you've done is ruin me factory floor, corrupt the young minds of my younger employees, take the piss out of me duty management. So I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to. There's a, oh, I'm drawing management, the line. What do you mean, the Blues Brothers? <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Look, here, this is a serious matter. I'm going to have to let you go. So if you'd like to go and sit on the settees in the living room and you spare the duration of the day there. Oh. Can't come in the office and you can't come in the factory, you're now sacked. Your name card's already gone, Harry. There's the door. Bye -bye. See you later. Go on, bitches. <laughs> Have we got any right to appeal on this? Yeah, we don't, up, like I said. Yeah, no, it takes 60 days for a response, so if you post that through. So um, then... Can we ask any questions? No. Uh, so you've got nothing else to do. You Take can... a seat, you make me nervous with you, Stan. <laughs> <laughs> What's that to you? Boss? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, boss. That's oh, okay. As you can see, I'm not <laughs> boss. So, <laughs> piss off. <laughs> well, it's been a pleasure working for you. I'd love to be able to see the CM. <laughs> Cheers for that. Oh. <clears throat> 
I'd say we ransacked the, the factory. I think we've done jolly well. I think we've done bloody well. Ah. 7.20 p.m. A duty manager is discussing the deer with the two sacked employees. But the task has been, the task is quite basic. It's been quite basic. It's literally... I, I, I think, even if I was a worker, though, I mostly would have joined in with you. Good. But with um, us or with the workers? But that's why I'm not, I'm not annoyed by anything you, you two or Har M Mark have done. I don't care in any way. Now the two troublemakers have been fired, productivity on the factory floor has increased. Any diamonds? Any diamonds anywhere? Yeah, there's a few of them yeah. knocking about. Yep, and uh, I've got a very weird what feeling. What do you want, Alex? Yep. What one? Red, 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 red diamonds. Back at the back of the back of the back of the back of the back Yeah, no, that's fine. Right. Mm -hmm. oh, Listen, well yes. done, everybody. Well done. Look me in the eye and tell me this was worth it. This was well, worth it. Was it? So if we've met the deadlines on the other stuff, then yeah, we've done the three. Yeah. So just stop and just chill, OK? Let's Congratulations, have everyone. Have yeah. You did absolutely yeah. amazing. That's free. Hand on! I have a feeling, because it's yeah, like... The fact that you lot have been treated like royalty yeah, today. That, it, it, big yeah, be, they, you're going to get it later. Yeah, yeah clearly. Get What's a hand getting everybody's boxes. OK. <laughs> <sighs> Right. Can't believe the state of this house. It's unbelievable. We want to tidy it up for our party later. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, boss. Hiya, big brother. Jay, how many packs of cards have you got there? 18. Just in case any are wrong. But I don't think so, because we've had them double-checked. Oh, you ready? Ah. Wait, wait, wait. Already, already. <laughs> Are you getting this? <laughs> 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 How have you enjoyed being the boss? It's been hard work, really, like, because... Way I wouldn't employ the people that I've had working for us, I know that. La 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 with any of this shopping budget, if it was up to me, the people who's grafted, I would just get them what they want. They want chocolate, if they want alcohol, the knackers would just get, you know what I mean, the chip peas and rice, because they, they honestly don't deserve it. Stressed us out a bit, you know what I mean? I just think you're just trying to be clever because of the fact you've got in the task people has been given the duty of being boss when every other shopping task you've actually attempted to get it at the end of the day. They will, everybody's going to suffer in the long run for their disobedience. Coming up... There's not a dry eye in the house. Fucking devastated. <laughs> Nine twenty-two p.m. Today, housemates became workers in a toy factory. Big Brother has just told housemates that they passed all three challenges. Tom succeeded in his secret mission to make the most toys and has boosted the luxury shopping budget to five hundred pounds. But not everyone is happy. Hello, Mark. Hi, big brother. You all right? How are you? As I said last night, nothing to do with anyone in there, but I still feel a little bit trapped in here and I still think that I want to go. What's happened today to make you feel this way? Nothing's happened today. I said that I was quite happy to think about it all day and I thought about it and I just feel like I've been here and I've done it and I just feel like, um, that's it. I think I'm ready to go. I feel proper, like, confined in here, like, really badly now. And, like, 
I feel like a trapped bee or something in a jar. And it'd be alright in the jar for a while when there's jam and stuff at the bottom, but once you've eaten that, you're done. What could happen in the Big Brother house that could make you want to stay? No more cameras, really. It's not about the people, it's about the cameras now. I like, I constantly, I'm, I'm, I'm now constantly aware I'm being filmed. I just feel trapped. And I just wanted the experience in here, and I had it, and I loved it, but I just feel like I'm at the end of my sell by date in here. I feel like I, I, I can now go out and, like, to the world. I want to go out to the world. I, I go out in the garden, I look up, and I think, do you know what? There's, like, a world out there. Mark? Yeah. Obviously, Big Brother would like you to stay because Big Brother values you as a housemate. Yeah, no, of course. However, if you're sure that you would like to leave... Yeah. ..and you're 100% certain that's what you would like to do, then Big Brother is able to facilitate you leaving the house. Yeah. So what Big Brother would suggest... Speak to your fellow housemates. Yeah. In the meantime, Big Brother will set the wheels in motion for you to leave the house in the morning. Yeah. Big Brother will call you back to the diary room in the morning. Yeah. And will ask you to make your final decision whether you'd like to stay in the house or whether you'd like to leave the Big Brother house. Yeah. Thank you, Mark. Return to the house. Thank you. Feeling how long time we're doing. I really feel head. like it's only been a month. A month? No. Nah. You've, been, you've been in pushing everyone's face. Oh, Finally, like, like fans. newspapers, What's magazines, fans. TV, every Cold. single day for a month. People and, uh, look like they see you every day. Oh, thank you. Right. You've been, like, oh, it's all like Tasha. You know, uh, you're right, Mark? Yeah. You know, when Tasha, you said, you know, she was upset, I was just like, oh. Stay too ready. Come here. You didn't say anything. Yeah, what's going on? Did you? Did you been in for a chat, Luke? Yeah. Um, I've got something massive to announce. Okay. Oh, God. Um, I think oh. I'm what? going tomorrow morning. What? what? Yeah. Why? No. What do you mean, Mark? Shut up. I just don't want to be filmed no more. What the fuck are you talking about? What are you talking about? Are you going to I just don't want to be filmed there no more. What? I know. Is he I know. Right? Are you talking about No, he's not. No, you can not tell he's being serious. No. What are you going on about, Mark? Honestly. I know. It's not. It's, 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 it's nothing to do with anyone. Like, there's no one person. There's no nothing. I just don't really want to be filmed anymore. Love, no, I'm being no, I'm being no serious. I, I, I don't. I don't want any fuss. And I, like, there's not. Please, yeah, 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 but there's. Yeah, there's okay, let him speak. Let him speak. There's nothing. Let him speak. There's, there's nothing any of you lot can do, because I don't want any fuss. But it's just. I've got. I've got a like, massive cabin fever in here now. Mm. I love looking at stuff. Like I don't like being trapped. I don't understand the, the thing of you being filmed. Is it because? Like you've been filmed for a month, so what does more matter to you? Because it's routine. Because it's routine for me. You don't, look, I, I tried to explain it to Harry the other day. I probably yeah. tried to explain it to Harry that some people can... It's like feeling claustrophobic. Some, people, like can up up over some, some people can sit in the background, right? Some people, when they're, when they're having a down day, can go sit in the background and stuff. Some people can do it. Some people can go there and they can sit in the background. I've never been able to do it. And when, like, big arguments and stuff kick off and all that, and I just go sit in the bath, it ain't worth it for me anymore. It's not worth me being here. It's no one's fault. There's not one single person I've got to blame for any of this. There's not, like they said to me, is there any of your fellow housemates? And it's not any of you lot. It's none of you lot at all. In fact, you lot are amazing. I've like, and when I go, you're going to see how amazing I think you all are as well. Like, you, will see, you will see how amazing I think you all are. You, you honestly will. But it's just... It's my decision. I always said, I said from day one, if I'm not having fun no more, I won't stay. I don't think you of anyone. Yeah, no, but I don't know. Yeah, 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 no, 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 no one did, but... but you've said, you said from I, day I, one, right? Really? <laughs> you've been said was from day one. You know you're going to regret this if you do it. Yeah, no, I know, but what, what I'm saying is, right... <sighs> I'm not like now it's routine. Everyone's different. You don't, you don't wind up. Nah, no, 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 of course I'm not winding you up. Nah, you of course I'm not winding you up. Well, come here, what are you doing? What are you doing? He can't take it anymore. He can't, he's cracked him. Jay, come on, move off here and give you a cuddle. What's he going for? No, it's it's got to him too much. Come here, come here. It's got to him too much. You need a hug. Come on, don't put your can down. Put the can down. Give me a proper cuddle. It's got to him, man. It's got to him. Do you know what? If he thinks it's going to keep getting to him, it's just going to get worse. And uh, there's no point getting upset, mate. Would bother 
nominating me. I could have stayed till Friday to find out what would happen, but none of you knobheads seem to nominate me. Honestly, I'm I can't so actually, shocked. like, process this in my head at the minute, Mark. I can't not be the centre of attention. And when you're in a house, when you're filmed 24 hours a day and you can't not be the centre of attention, it's very difficult. It's very difficult to live in my head. It's not easy at all. Mark, do you think there's any, any chance of you sleeping on it tonight and then deciding not to? Is there any chance at all? I thought I was going to go first thing this morning. Yeah. I thought I was going to wake up and go first thing this morning. I woke up in a really good mood, mm. but I still wanted to go. OK. So when you're in a good mood and want to go, yeah. you know it's the right thing. Eleven thirty-seven p.m. Lost. It's been just over two hours since Mark told housemates he was leaving in the morning. You can't help feeling like because I'm his best friend, I should be doing more to keep him here. But he's um, he's made his mind up, and he's sure this is the right thing to do. And I know it's not. I don't know what I'm going to do because I feel like the only time I'm smiling and happy is when I'm messing around with Mark, whether I'm being punched in the danglies or talking about football or making a silly prank or arguing about who's making the next tea. He's like, he's... He's my balance in here. He, he keeps me... happy. I've got, like, mountains of time for you. Right? I know, mate. I know. Do you know that? Mark. Yeah? I love you. I love you too, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking devastated. From day one, he'd said that as soon as he got bored, He's the kind of person that would up and leave. Um, and, in, and I still believed him from then, but thought it would never happen, because I just couldn't imagine him ever getting bored. He seemed to be entertaining himself really rather well. Never thought I'd be upset to see someone go in the house, um, especially not as upset as I was. Um, you know, it actually brought tears to my eyes, which I found bizarre. I don't know how it would feel, because you must feel horrible inside. It must be, like, no one knows how it feels. It must be horrible for you. It's not. I just feel like I want to go. I want Alex to win win it so she can't be complaining. <laughs> I want her to win it more than I want to win it myself. <laughs> no, it's not about winning no more. I don't want you saying shit like that for. We're only upset because we're just going to share that song. I know. She's just upset. I'm ready to go. I feel like someone's just stuck a screwdriver on my chest and flicked me heart out like a, with a black widow a catapult. Like, I'm seriously, seriously hurt. Is there no possibility of you staying? Not even the slightest chance. If I wake up tomorrow and I want to stay, I'll stay. How likely is that? It's pretty unlikely now I've made up my mind. Why have I cry? You are. I, mean, I never cry. You have an ear. Yeah, I know. It's a joke. Faye and I would be like the most dehydrated couple in history. I love you. This week, Fear and Mirzi will fierce the public vote. And this series, you can vote by phone or via Facebook. Who steers you decide to save Fear, call 0901616105. To see if Maisie, call 0901616105.
Calls cost 36p from a VT landline. Calls from other networks may vary, and for mobiles will cost considerably more. Or simply go to our page on Facebook, Big Brother UK, and follow the links. There's a minimum Facebook credit purchase of £1. One vote on Facebook will cost no more than 7p. For full terms, channel5.com slash bbvote. Voting closes in Friday's eviction show. This morning, Mark left the Big Brother house. Turn over to Five Star now for the exclusive interview.